Hi, my name is Vivian, and today we're going to be doing a sequence for fatigue, which was highly requested in a lupus awareness group that I'm in. This is one of my cats, Renzo, and he may or may not knock over the camera, so we'll see. Oh my gosh, there he goes. <laughs> Video shaky. Okay, so go ahead and roll out your mat. You won't need any props, and we'll go ahead and get started. So start in mountain pose, feet are hip width apart, and knees are soft, chest rises, crown of your head reach tall, palms facing forward, and your knees are just slightly soft. And just root down through all three corners of your feet. Start to close your eyes here or soften your gaze. Core is slightly engaged. Shoulders are back. Shoulders away from your ears. So tapping into how you're feeling today, physically, energetically, And emotionally. Just noticing without passing judgment. Now tune into your own breath. And start to blink your eyes open. Start to inhale as you raise your arms up. Soften your shoulders away from your ears. Exhale, push the air away as if it's going through honey. Inhale to lift up. Exhale to lower. Now you can start to go up on your tippy toes. Inhale. Lift up your heels, exhale, lower your heels down slowly. Inhale, lift up. And the heel part is totally optional. Exhale to lower. Inhale, going at your own pace, your own breath. Exhale, push the air away. On the next inhale, hold your breath. Inhale, hold for one, two, and then exhale, push the air away. Inhale to lift. Optional, hold your breath at the top of your inhale. One, two, three, and four. Lowering down. Let's do one more. The holding of the breath is totally optional. Inhale, at the top of the inhale, hold for four, three, two, one. Exhale, push the air away. And I'm gonna um, face this way so that you see this, my side body. Inhale to lift up, heels can stay rooted. Exhale to fold over, hinge at the hips, forward fold, knees are deeply bent. Inhale to half lift, hands are on your shin, neutral spine, head is in line with your hips. Exhale to bend your knees to fold. Inhale, circle your arms down, around and up, shoulders away from your ears. Exhale, push the air away, mountain pose. Inhale, lift your arms up overhead. Exhale, hinge at your hips, forward fold, knees are deeply bent. Stay here for two breaths. Inhale. Half lift, neutral spine. You can also push into your thighs. Exhale to fold. 
Inhale, circle your arms down, around, and up. Exhale, arms are by your side, mountain pose. Let's do that one more time. Inhale, circle your arms down, around, and up. Exhale, hinge at the hips, knees are deeply bent, forward fold. Stay here for four rounds of breath this time. Breathing deeply. Maybe you feel the sensation in your low back. Loosening up the tension in your neck, maybe shaking your head no, nodding your head yes. And one more deep breath in through your nose, out through your nose. And then half lift, hands into shins or your thighs. And then forward fold, just one count. Inhale, circle your arms down, around and up. Exhale, push the air away. Mountain pose. Go ahead and close your eyes here and just notice the sensations in your body. Notice your breathing. And how does your breathing compare to the beginning of our practice? And blink your eyes open and come to the front of your mat if you're not there already. Keeping your right foot rooted, step your left foot back with your left foot pointed at a 45 degree angle at the upper left corner of your mat. And you might want to widen your stance. So I'm pivoting my front foot to the right. And then bend your right knee. Inhale to lift up for warrior one. Stay here for a breath. And then a lower. Inhale, bend. Lift your arms up. Exhale, straighten your front knee. Arms are by your side. Inhale, lift up. Exhale, lower. Now go at your own pace, your own breath. Inhale to bend your front knee, pushing down through the outer back edge of your foot. Lower. Inhale to lift up and bend your knee. Power engage through both of your legs. Exhale to lower. Inhale to lift up, shoulders away from your ears. Crown of your head reaches forward. Exhale to lower. Inhale, hips are square to the front of the mat. Exhale, lower. You want to pivot your foot to the long edge of the mat. Feet are parallel. Just lift your arms up overhead. Gaze at the sky. And shift your weight to the toes and to your heels and then find somewhere in between and exhale lower hands are on your hips and then pivot your left foot so that it's your toes are pointed to the back edge of the mat maybe widen your stance getting your feet into warrior one again back toes are pointed at a 45 degree angle and pointed to the upper right corner of your mat and then hips Hands on your hips, making sure they're square to the front. Then inhale to bend your knee and lift your arms up. And when you bend your knee, just making sure that your knee does not go past your toes to protect the knee joint. And we'll do that moving warrior one again. One more inhale here. Exhale, lower your hands to your sides. Inhale, lift up your arms overhead. Soften your shoulders down. Exhale, push the air away. Inhale, lift up. Exhale, push the air away. And going at your own breath, inhale to lift up. Exhale, pushing the air away. Core is engaged. 
pushing down through the outer edge, your pinky toe side of your right foot. Feeling the strength in both legs, in both arms. One more cycle and exhale. Hands on your hips this time and point your toes to the long edge of the mat. And you can heel toe in and standing down into Tadasana. You can tune inward here. And again, you can close your eyes or soften your gaze. Just noticing how your breath feels. Keep your eyes closed or you can blink them open as you bring your feet about shoulder width apart, hands to heart center, and lower your hips down to a yogi squat. And you can just drop your hips down gently and coming into any comfortable seat that you can stay for a brief meditation and a brief breathing exercise. Just making sure that your spine is long and you can also do this laying down if, um, if the seat is not serving you today. Honor where your body is today and go at your own pace. So coming to any comfortable seat or laying down, you can either bring your hands to ground down by putting the palm face down, or if you want to receive, you can bring them palms facing up in your knees or in your lap. And then we'll just do a brief meditation. And you can either repeat the affirmation while you're being in silence, which is, I am excited to meet my day, and this excitement gives me energy. I am excited to meet my day, and this excitement gives me energy. So feel free to use that affirmation, or if you have your own, feel free to use that during this time. I will repeat it one more time. I am excited to meet my day, and this excitement gives me energy. And we'll just be here in silence for about 10 breaths. If you choose not to use the affirmation, just focus on your breathing, maybe noticing where you feel it the most in your body. And we'll come back after 10 breaths to lead us to our breathing exercise. Soften your face here. Release your jaw. Take a final breath. The breath work we'll be doing today is called Krama Pranayama, which is a three-part breath. If you find the three-part breath challenging, feel free to go in two sections, and you'll see what I mean as soon as I instruct. Go ahead and take a big, we'll be breathing in three parts, filling up in sections. So go ahead and take a deep inhale. And then take a deep exhale, exhale all the air out. Inhale one third of the way through your nose, filling up your belly. Pause. 
Take an inhale two thirds of the way, filling up your abdomen. Pause. And then filling up all the way into your chest. The deepest breath, full inhale. Pause. And then hold here. And then exhale in one steady, smooth breath through your nose. As soon as you breathe the air out, pause. We'll do that several more times. Inhale one third of the way, pause. Inhale two thirds of the way, pause. Inhale all the way, filling up your chest. Maybe shoulder rises, pause, and then exhale in one smooth state, exhaling the air from your chest, your abdomen, your belly, pause. Breathe in one third of the way, pause. Breathe in two thirds of the way, Pause, then breathe in all the way, pause. Now for your exhale, you can do the same or you can pause in sections as well. Exhale with your chest, pause. Exhale the air from your abdomen, pause. Exhale all the way out, all the air from the belly, navel goes into spine, pause. Now do this on your own, with your own breath, making sure you're sitting tall, doing the three-part breathing. Feeling your body expand, your belly expand, chest expands with inhales. And feeling your chest fall, belly goes into spine as you exhale. The pauses are totally optional on your exhales. So do what feels right in your body today. No tension, no difficulty, just ease. One more cycle, one more inhale, and one more exhale. When you're done, go ahead and release any conscious breathing and come back to your natural breath. Just noticing your natural breathing here. And now noticing how you're feeling at the end of our practice, physically, energetically, and emotionally. Just notice without passing any judgment, just observe. Keeping your eyes closed, rub your thighs with your hands, creating some heat. And bring your palms at heart center and rub them together here. And bringing the palms over your eyes, 
and just feeling the warmth from the palms of your hands. Bring your hands back down to heart center or in your lap and just acknowledging yourself for moving your body today, even though you're feeling fatigued and honoring yourself for taking this time to move the energy around in your body. I hope you enjoyed the practice today. Thank you for being here.